Hey, it's Kimberly with StampinByTheSea.com and this morning I'm here to show you how to make this fun card using our Artisan Embellishments Kit. Now, what I've done is you get uh, one of these beautiful, delicate doilies that is in a heart shape and I've already sprayed this with some gold shimmer and I actually heat set it just so it would dry a little bit faster. I'm going to just fold these in half and just crinkle them just a wee bit. And I'm going to actually pull out my little sewing machine. This is my Gen Genomi Sew Mini. And I'm actually going to put these two pieces together and I'm just going to sew it down the middle. And I'll explain why here in just a sec. I'm going to just do a little zigzag stitch. And the reason I wanted to put the two together is just to give it a little bit more texture. Uh, it made it look a little bit fluffier. Now, pulling this off the needle, you want to be careful just because it is a delicate doily. And we'll pinch those off. Move the sewing machine. And we're just going to cut these delicate little threads off. All right, and now you can see we're going to crinkle this up just a wee bit because I want it to pop up just a little when it's on the card. And you can see that here. You can see it's got a little bit of a lift there, and that's exactly what I wanted. But in the meantime, you've got to be careful because the doilies are delicate. All right, so before I uh, started, I went ahead and put this together. I also did a zigzag stitch on... Um, this piece, and this is that, um, oh, what is that color? Let me turn my thing. Primrose Petals. I can never remember that name. We're going to put this on first. We're going to put that, oh, about right there. And next we're going to put the doily on. And I think I'll actually use another dimensional on that, too. I don't need it to go all the way down, as long as it stays there. And you can find this in our Artisan Embellishment Kit. I love, love that kit. It's very delicate, very vintage, very fun. So next what I've done is I've cut a heart from my Heart Collection framelits. And I love these framelits because I've got uh, six, let's see, one, two, three, six different sizes. One that is huge with the scallop. I love that. For this particular card, I used the third little heart. And then once I had that cut with the So Saffron cardstock, I went ahead and ran it through my Vine Street uh, textured embossing folder. Now, the Vine Street is a celebration item, so you spend $50 and you get that for free. What I did next was took the Artisan Embellishment button here, and it's a beautiful brass button as you can see. And I went ahead and used a large board needle and threaded it with some linen thread and brought it up so it would be sewn on. And then we'll just tie that into a bow. Just like that. So now that we have this on, we're going to put a little piece of pink pirouette. This was from my color challenge this week. I hope you're following that. It's just a little bit of inspiration to get you through. If you're color challenged or need a boost, it's a great thing to, to start off with. Pull these dimensionals off. We're going to put that just right on the back like that so it just comes a peek out of that. Now to get that cardstock to um, to curl just a little bit, just take your bone folder and run it through your hand like that and it'll give it a nice little curl so it really is a pretty banner. And once again we're going to use uh, some dimensionals on this and you don't need many. Put one here, one there, and we're going to plop this on our card. I'm going to put that oh, about right there. I'm going to trim the tails, and there you go. A simple little card using the Artist Embellishment Kit. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again.